Now, South Africa's Zulu king, Goodwill Zwelitini, has died at the age of 72 after weeks in hospital. The king wielded great influence among millions of Zulus uh, through his largely ceremonial and spiritual role, despite having no official power in modern South Africa. Now, the king... South Africa's Zulu king, Goodwill Zwelitini, died on Friday, age 72, the royal family said in a statement. He had been admitted to a KwaZulu-Natal hospital for diabetes treatment when his health took a turn for the worse. South Africans like Noni Kazmiro reacted with shock and sadness to the king's passing. We've lost our pillar. We've lost our leader. We've lost um, someone who was so culturally away, someone who was bringing all the pieces together. I feel like um, it's not just the loss for the Zulu nation, but the loss of, of culture in itself and the people in South Africa, because that's what we're all about. South African President Cyril Ramaphosa said in a statement that His Majesty will be remembered, quote, as a much-loved visionary monarch and commended his contribution to cultural identity, national unity and economic development, not just in KwaZulu-Natal, but throughout the country. On the streets of Johannesburg, Lazarus Apane described it as a great loss. Given the fact that historical uh, magnitude of Amazulu, him leading Amazulu through difficult times, uh, during apartheid, seeing Amazulu nation triumph to democratic dispensation. Zolatini's reign spanned turbulent decades in South Africa. He assumed the throne at the height of apartheid and went on to rule through the country's most violent decades, a period which included a dispute over the role of the Zulu monarchy. That spilled over into post-apartheid South Africa, when the country's new constitution recognised traditional leaders along with its democratically elected government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.